I was actually surprised at how much they showed of Final Fantasy VII yeah. the remake. Yeah, and it wow. looks really good. Holy crap! Uh, it looks it's crazy good. Very real time now. Yeah. Which, yep. uh, I didn't. I think it looked so good that no one really stopped to get angry about that, which is pretty cool. Um, I think people kind of want a more traditional turn base, but I guess not. Like the game looks gorgeous. There's yeah. like. It, it took me a second to get if it would work with the new visuals. And somehow, like, that sort of can't be symphonic theme still still nails it, even though yeah. everything's fucking gritty and Can falling apart. Can we address how Barrett looks like Blade now? No, he's yeah. totally Blade. Like, he just looks, yeah, very much Look like a, the, a larger Blade. Man, even, like, the reflections on the back of his sword and stuff. Like, it's so, just gorgeous. I think that, obviously, the, the switch to what seems like action RPG approach is probably going to scare off a lot of hardcore fans, or at least piss them off. Yeah. Uh, obviously... People who are hardcore fans of Final Fantasy VII are going to play this. Yeah. That's that's a given. Uh, I think that this is also trying to attract a new audience, and that's something that kind of acknowledged, you know? I mean, this is the kind of the same shift we saw with, like, you know, Fallout 2 to Fallout 3. Yeah, it's, and I, th I think the thing is, like, by now, Final Fantasy fans, or at least, like, the really hardcore ones, are used to combat systems like this. They've been sort of readily available in the last few Final Fantasies. And I think, like, even if you want something turn-based, you can kind of give it a pass, because this looks so good. Look at those numbers like, flying out. Yeah, the, the sparks and lighting so effects and all, the, all that kind of stuff. People were losing it over this. It looked oh, yeah. awesome.